Ghost. <laughs> What's up guys out here for a, for a quick run kind of on the just on the whim i just uh, decided to get purple back out um i've got the forest outcast too gonna give gonna give her a second run i did run it in the yard yesterday and my slipper clutch uh, ended up needing needing adjustment but other than that is she's still all just bone stock i've done nothing to the truck but turn up to a punch five on esc but i did go all the way tight on the slipper and then out half a turn um, i tried a quarter turn and it was just a little too tight and the truck was way too touchy so it seems like a half a turn is just right um, but on uh, on my uh, purple outcast here um, she went back she's going back to her roots with the guitars um, i forgot just how incredible this truck is with the guitars on it and how lightweight and just how good it handles you know i was playing around this in the yard too and it's, it's just a complete animal you know running this setup with the suspension setup that's on it as well so we're gonna give it a quick run and uh, just to try to get the feel in and uh, see how it goes. Oh, that was rough. Oh man, that was close. <laughs> side too <laughs> that's some arma tough right there that's going to be the retirement of this body. <laughs> I've had this body almost a year now, believe it or not. Yeah, that busted a body mount. <laughs> it's all cracked up.
Oh, that was LVC right coming off that hill. <laughs> yeah, she is just a complete animal with the guitars. Forgot how it was. I'm glad I set her back but to that. But yeah, it looks like this body's about toast. I can't... <laughs> it's, like I said, it's been on here almost a year anyway. So I'm, I'm, I'm you know, surprised I got that long out of it. So well, she's going to be uh, needing a new one soon. And of course, she's, if anybody's wondering, she's still going to be purple. Might do a different shade, but... Anyway, this thing was a complete animal once again. Yeah, actually I tried to put the uh, guitars on it yesterday just to uh, get her to handle a little bit better and just see how it performed. But they were just a little bit added, uh, a little bit too narrow for the truck to where it would end up scrubbing on the body and stuff. Doesn't have the, quite the offset, so I just put the stock tires back on it. It's the stock uh, mini backflips are very similar to the uh, Proline 3.8 Badlands, so I didn't even bother putting those on it. They're about the exact same size. That was a hard slap. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh man, that hurt. <laughs> uh, did not expect that to happen. <laughs> oh, oh, and there goes the tire. All right, yeah, the screw must uh, the screw must have backed out from the inside that holds this uh, little end axle piece on. So I'm gonna go ahead and call it quits anyway. It's like really hot out here. It's in the upper 90s today, and it's just I know this thing's getting hot. So, but it was definitely a blast with uh, getting purple back out, getting another good run with this thing. Um, I have to make sure you know to check these uh, check these screws on your end axles and uh, maybe put a little Loctite on them. Anyway, a little outcast is a blast. All right, until next time, guys. Peace out.